Fight WMAC now with your host Chuck Stevenson coming at you with yet another fight review. This time we're going all the way to Tokyo, Japan for one championship, a new era in the 115 pound division. One championship calls it Adam Weight. Uh, we have VV May Yamaguchi 18, 11, and 1 taking on uh, one championship newcomer, Ksenia the Tigress Lachkova coming in at 10 and 2. Uh, bring up the little picture here. It has the tail of the tape. You'll see big disparity in size difference, uh, roughly like seven inches. Um, so you had size advantage versus experience advantage. Um, experience, of course, went to Mei Yamaguchi. So this fight just got started out. Uh, Lachkova was doing very well in the stand-up and, you know, just keeping uh, Yamaguchi on the edge of her punches. She was landing nice jabs, a uh, couple couple nice crosses, uh, but just otherwise mostly just keeping Yamaguchi at the end of uh, her range. Uh, very nice, nicely done, I thought, by her. That was That's the way to fight Yamaguchi. Yamaguchi, of course, needed to uh, better on the ground, um, so she was trying to get in and get the takedowns, but she just really wasn't able to in the first round. Uh, second round, Yamaguchi started doing a little bit better. Lachkova again, still though, was mostly keep trying to keep her on the outside of her range, but about partway through the round, Yamaguchi found a hole and got in and got the takedown, and the rest of the round was spent there with Yamaguchi landing a uh, carefully uh, chosen uh, ground and pound. A uh, lot of punches to the body, which I like. Um, I don't I think body punches are underutilized a lot in the ground and pound. And so the fight, or excuse me, the second round ended on the ground. Uh, third round, Mei Yamaguchi started finding a, a better home for her big right. I think that uh, Lachkova was a little more tired. I think those uh, punches to the body in the second round on the ground were starting to take their toll. Uh, Lachkova started, she almost had like, was using her shoulder to block. Uh, the overhand right from Yamaguchi, but the more uh, Yamaguchi's threw it, the more she started to land it. I mean, she'd dart in and throw it, and eventually that left Lachkova wide open. She was so worried about the overhand right that Yamaguchi was just able to go straight in and grab a nice double leg uh, pass to uh, half, half guard, and then not long after, uh, pass to mount, and then Yamaguchi was able to lock on latch on an armbar, uh, forcing Ksenia Lachkova to tap out, uh, giving Mei Yamaguchi the victory at about 3 minutes 18 seconds of round number 3. Congrats to Mei Yamaguchi, who I believe is 36 years old now, uh, still doing very well and, you know, often fighting against uh, bigger opponents and one championship. So things to work on. Uh, Lachkova, I think, needs to work on her takedown defense a little more um, and definitely work on uh, fighting off of her back more. Uh, Yamaguchi, I thought, did fought a very excellent fight. Um, she started to find her way in to get uh, that overhand right that she's known for going. And then she got the takedowns, of course, that she needed in the second and third round. So not really a whole lot for her to work on otherwise. As far as matchmaking goes, um, it's nice to have a, a new face in one championship's 115 pound division in Lachkova. Uh, I think she'll uh, match up pretty well against uh, some of the other fighters there, especially with her uh, height and reach. Uh, Yamaguchi, it's gonna be a little harder to match her up because there aren't many fighters that she in that division that she hasn't faced already. Uh, so other than that, I mean, there's not a whole lot to say about this fight. It was a good fight. Um, and it was nice to see uh, Mei Yamaguchi get a win uh, in her hometown of Tokyo, fighting for in Japan for the first time since, uh, I think, four years almost. So uh, that's all I have to really say about this fight, guys. Let me know what you thought about it in the comments down below. And what are you waiting for? Subscribe to WMAC Now, the best, fastest growing women's mixed martial arts platform on YouTube. Guys, check you next time.